Welcome to another Transformers Legacy review. This time we'll be looking at the Leader Class Blitzwing. And then we have Blitzwing in his vehicle mode. He is a fighter jet, a Jack Holland fighter jet, yeah. Nice looking jet mode. On the top, the wings, he has a Decepticon symbol. He has both Decepticon symbols on there. Engines on the back. Nothing on the bottom. Him. He has Glanny here. So yeah. The cockpit and, and then and one thing he does do triple changers. So yeah, we're gonna get him into his tank mode to try. So yeah. I love this view mode a lot. Purple and to, to get him to his tank mode. First I'm gonna start by take the wing. Move the landing gear. I'm trying. There we go. Take the nose cum and close it down. And then close it there. this we're gonna go by fast so here we go this is a little tricky because they are not very tight hold on I still to get them right Thing they have to fold forward. I'm gonna show you the robot mode. So, oh. But this thing, they have to fold forward. Like, actually, no way. They have to fold like this. Well, I'm gonna show you this robot mode. There we go. There we go. Make sure it doesn't attached. Take the guns out. Take them here and flip them down. They are very tight. Here. 
And there you have him in his tank mode. Nice looking tank mode. I love this figure a lot now. But this is really hard to do dealing with the triple changer toy. You can see the tank mode is awesome. It's got turns, nothing in the back. Trends, nothing on the bottom too. The front, this thing, the turret things move. You can move over there around, but you don't. The guns move up. These guns do not move around. Up. These guns move up and down. Because I'm pretty happy with this figure. Let's see if I get a G1 Blitzwing. Right now. On the top, he has a Decepticon symbol on there. Overall, I'm pressing this figure. But it's really hard to do with the triple changer leader class to start to transform him to robot mode first I'm gonna start by here okay to the legs too. There we go. There we go. Yep. There we go. And then flip up the feet. There you go. We're gonna go to the cockpit. We're not gonna go to the cockpit with the cockpit down from there. We're gonna go over there. And also, I'm gonna go to, to the hands up here. Take the hands out. There we go. And do the same on these. Okay. You can't really see it. And then, there we go. Sorry about that. You can, if you want to put this gun in here, you can do the other, like you can do, you can do the other way, but you can't see his gun, you can see his gun, which, I guess you can do like this. Yeah, that would be great idea. Make did just like make him like a G1 actor. G1 is a TV show actor.
Okay. And there he is, Blitzwing in robot mode. Now let's take a look at him in his robot mode. Because I love this figure a lot now. Overall, I love this figure. I love this figure a lot. He also comes with two guns. Guns. He also comes with a sword too, which I would not even use a sword. Look, you can use a sword like this. Or you can take this other gun here too. Then you can distort his sword on the back too. Which is very neat. Very cool looking figure. Nice like an action figure though. Look at that. Let's take a look at him real quick in his room on that. I'm pretty impressed with this figure named Blitzwing. I'm very happy about this. And Jen, he has a Decepticon symbol in there. There's his face here. Blitzwing. Let's have a gun too. And overall, I am very happy with this figure. I'm uh, very excited. Now let's get G1 Blitzwing. I'll get another Transformer Figures too. That's what I'm thinking about it too. Until next time, thank you for watching.